friends welcome to java coding skill in this video uh, we gonna talk about who who is front end developer and who is back end developer if you remember our previous video uh, where we talk about what is front end and what is back end if you didn't watch that video i will request you to go and watch that video first uh, so you will get some prior idea to get you know uh, some better understanding uh, for this video link given in this, uh, description uh, please go and check that so a uh, front end developer the who uh, develop the front end and we can also say the ui developer as well some of them are telling front end developer some of them are telling ui developer so to developing the front end then might two more person required one is ui designer one is ui developer i will create one altogether different video on that particular topic ui developer and ui designer so for time being you can understand front end developer who develop this ui the screen what are the thing you are able to see what are the thing appearing on the screen on their display that is developed by front end developer let us understand with one real example so this is the gmail account page where we can create any new account let me type something here anything right? let me type automatically uh, this getting populated i didn't type this so that much intelligence uh, it have right how it we have like this first of all uh, before uh, understanding the functionality first we will talk about appearance here we will get some beautiful box and some icon here and here some text field then password field and this i icon and next button signing instant lot of thing so who designed this that design uh, done by a ui designer and then who provide the functionality to this ui developer i will talk about you know, ui designer and developer for time being you can understand consolidated we can say front end developer what are the thing you are seeing on the screen all done by the ui developer is designer or we can say front end developer let us check uh, next thing if you click on this next button it's automatically telling you enter a password means some validation also given here even this validation given it's also done by the front end developer because it's client side validation request not it sent to the server if something done at server side that called backend and that coding done by backend developer something associate with ui only the scope which is till the ui all those thing developed by front end developer so let me enter some password here let me press next so before that let me provide some valid email id here if you notice that here that username is taken try another that means this validation happen at server side otherwise how this user interface get to know whether this user already taken by someone else or not that means one request went to the server and the server some validation is written in such way that will go into the database check whether this java coding skills email already taken by someone else or not if already taken by someone else it send us to response by saying this this is invalid and here password and they say take some stronger password so let me take some stronger password here yeah 
see password part is gone this password kind of validation it might at client side or it might server side as well we can't say because it's up to the developer or business or the product owner or person who is developing the particular thing but coming to this thing of course we can say without checking into the database how can people get to know whether it's developed whether it's occupied by someone else or not so it's common sense so we can say this is server side validation so something involved at server side that is developed by backend developer if you provide some email id which is not already taken by someone else account will going to create so i mean to say what all the thing you are able to see here what all the functionality you are able to see here like validation this coloring if there are some red icon coming here so this dynamic uh, validation and behavior provided by the ui developer designer consolidated or we can say front end so what are the roles the responsibility by the back end developer then so let us understand by this i took this page here this ui part you done right so front end developer responsibility you have some idea on that so what are the appearance you are able to see that plus what are the client side validation and some dynamic nature they providing to the page to give some good look and feel developed by front end developer and this code moreover running on the browser side only it's not executing on the server it's executing on your side means user side client side on the browser side or the mobile application if mobile application internally it's also using some browser or not so what are the things the scope is just to the particular local machine it's not it uh, executed on the server side it's called front end uh, technology and it's done by front end developer so front end developer role i think you are clear so let us understand back end part here if you fill this form click on next this server uh, and this request goes to the server so all the information reached to server so all this form what all the information you filling here here if you click on this next button it will reach to the server this is server you can see so what are the step required here first the server will read all the information which is coming from the text field like first name it's reading first name it's reading the last name username username password okay this uh, for information and confirm password as well to just check whether both password are equal or not so this will be as we can't uh, tell whether it's happening on the client side or server side based on the use case some of them not uh, believing on the ui validation so they are doing one more round validation on the server side as well so this could be common it's, it might happening on the both side so uh, this information reached to the server this is first step if this information reached here server will perform some operation like validation first part validation if validation passed next step they will save into the data they will save into the data if validation fail they, they sending some error messages to the client so what all the thing happening on the server end this server end validation first 
if well jason passed this checking whether the email is well uh, miss well jason miss that email check as well we can see this they checking whether both password are equal or not whether that email is already exist in db or not so for that they have to write some code if email id is already available send some error if not save it so these three part right these three things which happening at the server end called server side program and this server side programming done by the back end so here two things front end developer front end developer done with this thing and back end developer done this thing so what are the thing front end developer done they designing this space this designing providing some validation using javascript or any uh, framework they can use they posting the data to the server they sending this data to the server if response successfully happen so they redirect to some other profile page or somewhere page if something went wrong showing the error so these five thing this front end developer doing here and what are the back end developer doing to in order to achieve this thing first of all back end developer need to create one database where they store this data so back end responsibility is creating the database table and create some server side programming language in server side programming language they have to perform these operation which already we taught perform validation check the availability of the email save the data so all these things done by the back end developer so i think we are almost able to understand what all the front end developer responsibility what is the back end developer responsibility if you have any uh, question or any doubt regarding this uh, front end developer and back end uh, developer please uh, mention your comment in the comment section and if you need any further you know video on any of the topic related to this kind of thing so uh, please let me know so i will uh, try to create the video on those topic as well so thanks for watching it please like and subscribe the channels and press the bell icon to not miss any future notifications